place to call home? A freshman who is discovering the innards of University of Santo Tomas, commonly known as USD, says no problem. The home of the Tigers is known for its rich and diverse culture that leads to massive and unforgettable occurrences. Altogether, let's join her in her curiosity as she finds out and experiences the iconic events and various annual celebrations of the university from welcome walk to Paskuhan to the graduation of her fellow Tomasians and everything in between that all take place in the USD campus, her new home. These events will surely make her Tomasian journey to become an unforgettable experience full of precious memories. Are you curious about her adventures on finding out the traditional events of USD? Watch her become a mighty tiger here in Viva Santo Tomas. Hello and good morning. So currently, I am looking for a freshman who I can help guide in unlocking the mysteries of our magnificent university. Hey, there! I see a freshman! Um, excuse me? Are you a freshman? Apo, freshman po. Uh, can I ask a few questions? That's good. What's your name? Where do you live? What strand and what? Uh, hi, I'm Athena Patricio. I am from Aparicagayan Valley. And my strand is STEM. And I chose STEM because I want to be an IT specialist in the Why did you choose UST? I chose UST because I know that UST is one of the best universities in the country. And, and I know that being a Tomasian will make my school life more interesting and exciting. What do you know about UST? UST is known for being the oldest Catholic university in Asia and it is the Royal Pontifical and Catholic University of the Philippines. What events are you familiar with? Um, I'm familiar with Paskuhan and UAA. What are the things you're curious about in the UST? I'm curious about the different events that are held inside the campus and I'm also curious about the history of the university. Are you ready? Because we are about to go to the Ark of the Centuries. This Ark has stood as one of the most oldest structures in the UST, where each and every student has to pass through it to finally become a Thumashan. Welcome to UST. The University of Santo Tomas in Manila, Philippines marks a variety of traditions largely influenced by the Filipino-Dominican culture. Many are annual events such as religious assemblies marking the start and end of the academic year. A welcome walk for new students. Welcome walk is a part of the process of becoming a Tomasian as they say. It is the beginning of every Tomasian's journey. Here in USD, you're not yet a real Tomasian unless you enter the Ark of the Centuries. Since we can't get a hold of Zarina personally, we decided to call her for Athena to interview her. Hello, Athena po. Hi, Ate. This is Athena. lang po sana. Ah, hello. Ikaw pala yan. Ah, sige. What's your name? Saan department po kayo galing? Anong course and year level na po kayo? I'm Verena from Dove Dove 14 from Senior High School. On my first year in USC, I had an amazing welcome orientation. I wasn't able to walk through the arc with my classmates, but they helped me have my own fun experience. Although I had my share of experiences of the welcome walk this year, I was one of the stems of volunteers during the ALA walk. I witnessed how excited the freshmen were. I find this year's welcoming ceremonies more festive and united. The themes of each strand were much more related to each other. The orientation this year was bombastic since they provided a wider stage in the middle of the pavilion. And the program was much more engaging for the students. Can you give me an advice that may help me in my Tomasian adventure? Make the most out of your first year in USD. You'll meet new people that can help you get through hard times, especially emotionally and academically. Stick to the cheap but solid food. Wag lang sa car park kasi trust me. Na hug yung tigong masas when you already have too much requirements that involves money. Just have your savings ready for your unexpected gastusin. Attend to the senior high or university-wide events of USD because you'll never know what you're gonna miss. The student leaders provide Extraordinary programs for the students that serves as your break from your academic stress. Besides, you don't want to push yourself to the, your stress limit. How was ALAB 2018 and welcome 
off for you. Siyempre, nung alam, nag-enjoy ako kasi parang yun yung pinaka first official Damasyan activity ko na na-attended sa USD. Pero I think na ang sad lang kasi hindi nakapasok yung batch namin sa may part of the century. Eh, di ba kasi parang yun yung tradition na parang every Damasyan nakapasok doon. Tapos ang unfortunate lang na sa batch namin, hindi kami nakapasok. Hi po, what's your name? Sa ang department po kayo galing? Anong course and le year level na po kayo? Um, my name is Jamie Precious Nila Sapungan. Tapos I'm from a freshman student of the USTAMB College of Accountancy. Sin. So you have experienced the SHS Welcome Walk and also the College Welcome Walk. What do you think is the difference? For me, wala din pong siyang difference. Pero... Kasi parang every welcome walk naman, mas lalo siya nagiging masaya. Iba't ibang tao nga lang yung nakakasama mo. Since yung high school, high school classmates may kasama mo, yung senior high school naman, mga senior high school yung kasama mo. Go, ste! Go, ste! Go, ste! Go, 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 go! This is undeniably the best year from the best crowd in the UAAP. Here in UST, where champions in life are born, we are all a mighty tiger who came to cheer and to win it with no fear. Supporting the athletes in their games and cheering them is a very memorable and fun experience. The University Athletic Association of the Philippines, established in 1938, is an athletic association of eight Metro Manila universities in the Philippines. Varsity teams from these universities compete annually in the league's 28th event from 15 sports to vie for the overall championship title. UST has the most titles with 42 in the seniors division and 19 in the juniors division. We are also the defending overall champion, and this season, we are ready to roar and defend our crown to go for a three-peat championship. So here we are at the USC Quadricentennial Pavilion, where most of our commendable athletes hone their skills in preparation for the UAAP Games. Who knows? Maybe Athena might become our future champion. What UAAP sport do you prefer, and who is your favorite player? Basketball is my favorite since the player's determination and teamwork is reflected on the court. For me, my favorite player is Renzo Subido because he was able to show good team play and good sportsmanship. Here are some interviews from our hardworking athletes. Hi, I'm si Pauline Bernate, College of Rehabilitation Science, 1PTA. How important is UAAP for you and what are your preparations for it? Para sa akin, yung UAAP is isa sa pinakamalaking event sa pagiging athlete ko dito sa UST. Siyempre, nagpe-prepare ako gamit ng pag-training lagi. Tsaka, minamind, sinaset ko rin sa mind ko na kaya kong gawin lahat ng baka kaya ko para manalo. As a university, have you ever considered leaving the team for the sake of your grades? Oo, kasi siyempre ngayon yung college, mahirap na. Kasi lalo na sa course ko na physical therapy, nahirapan ako i-manage yung time ko. Pero naisip ko din na isa rin naman yung sport ko para magpatuloy din ako. Kasi nagiging inspiration ko siya para gawin ko yung best ko. How does it feel representing University of Santo Tomas? I feel proud kasi hindi naman lahat ng tao pwedeng i-represent ang UST. Tsaka yun. How important is UAAP for you and what are your preparations for it? UAAP, UAAP para sa akin, napakahalaga siya. Parang naging part na siya ng buhay ko. So parang every UAAP, parang lahat talaga ng trainings, lahat ng da, ano, eating healthy foods, yun talaga yung pinaprepare ko. Tapos yung katawan ko din, pinaprepare ko before mag up As a varsity, have you ever considered leaving the team for the sake of your grade? Um... Grades naman kasi talaga, mahalaga rin para sa akin. Pero as much as possible, hindi ko iiwan yung team ko para lang sa grades. As much as possible, kailangan ko siyang dapat i-balance since dapat may time for training and may time do for Akans. Paskuhan is one of the most popular events in UST, not only for Thomasians, but also for non-Thomasians. Paskuhan is the Thomasian way of celebrating Christmas. It is one of the most awaited events of the year, showcasing different performances from different student organizations and live bands, which is complemented with an extravagant show of pyrotechnic. 
Pascuan is the culmination of the university-wide Christmas activities of the University of Santo Tomas in Manila, Philippines. The annual tradition started in 1991. The programs of the Pascuan were held during the last week or last day before the Christmas break of the university. Behind you with that humongous Christmas tree is our very own Grandstand Stadium where Athena might just experience the most famous and iconic events here in the University of Santo Tomas, which is Paskuhan. Hi po, what's your name? Saan department po kayo galing? Anong course in year level na po kayo? I'm Francis Carlo M. Abilar from the Senior High School Department under the STEM strand and I'm from 12 STEM 14. What does Paskuhan mean for you? Paskuhan uh, is a itong gathering not not just for the Tomasians and also for the non-Tomasians. Kung saan dito kami pwede mag-unite and mag-celebrate ng Christmas in a very Tomasian way. Uh, ang raming events na nasakop nito uh, katulad ng agape pati yung concert and hindi hindi mo wala ang fireworks. Paskuhan is one of the most recognizable events in UST not only for the students but also for non-Tomasians. Why is that so? Siguro yun nga, sasagot ko kanina, isa itong way kung paano magsasama-sama ang lahat ng Tomasians at kasama na rin ang friends nila. Also because dahil kasama din ang outsiders and yun, makaka-enjoy sila ng isang Christmas vibes or Pasguan vibes uh, kasama yung mga taong malalapit sa kanila. As most of us are aware, the UST prepares a special week for each and every one of its senior high school students aptly named the SHS Week. This tradition has been going on for quite a long time now and this year's SHS Week's results will not leave you disappointed. With the theme being, Diversify, fortifying the spectrum of brilliance and integrity. We experience a week-long array of events of various nature organized by different local organizations in UST Senior High School. From academics to colorful parades, assignments to competitions, and a music fest that left 8,000 students breathless. This event is something you definitely don't want to miss. BGPOP is where most of the senior high related events take place, such as the SHS Week. Whether be it aspiring directors or aspiring engineers, this is where students take their very first step in becoming something bigger in this world. This is also where Athena might discover her true potential. What were your great and worst experiences during the SHS Week? Isa siguro sa pinaka-greatest experiences ko ng senior high school week is yung uh, kasama ko ibang student leaders ng student council. Bumisita kami sa office ni Lenny Robredo, the office of the vice president, sa Quezon City para lang uh, i-deliver yung mga in-offer na goods ng misa ng senior high school week. What events or booths caught your eyes during the SHS week and what made it unique? Isa siguro na event na nakakuha talaga ng eye ko is yung Zephyros Music Festival na naganap nung last day na ng Senior High School Week kung saan lahat ng uh, Tomasian artists, particularly Senior High School Tomasian artists, uh, binigay ang kanilang best sa kanilang mga uh, talents, especially sa field ng uh, arts and music and especially dahil sa uh, special guest namin na ang Four of Spades. What have you learned after you listened to the interviews? Um, I learned that USC has a rich and diverse history which are the roots of USD's iconic events. Are you excited to finally start your Tomasian experience? Yes, I'm very excited to finally start my Tomasian experience. After this successful documentary, Athena finally started her Thomasian experience with the help of our team. Since it has been 8 years, we decided to catch up, so we looked for her number and finally called it. Hello? Athena Puto? Hi Athena, this is Kurt. Remember 8 years ago when we wanted you to be a part of our documentary to help you out with your Thomasian experience? Well, here we are again, and we just 
wanted to ask you a few questions of how your life's been going so far. So how's life? What happened to your journey in USD? Um, uh, so yun nga, uh, naging masaya naman and uh, meaningful naman yung naging journey ko sa USD. Do you have any advice for our incoming freshmen? So yung tip ko, huwag mong effort yung sarili mo sa isang group kasi Sumasans are welcoming people and sobrang approachable nila. And makasama mo rin naman yung mga tao na you're meant to be with in time. Second, try and participate in more activities prepared by the school kasi baka hindi mo na, baka hindi mo na ma-experience yun in the future. Well, Athena, it's been fun. Thank you again for participating and we wish you all the best for your future endeavors. May God bless you. And we hope to see you again sometime.